Right, the Cumberland Plate from Carlisle have a one mile three. There's five horses in the Cumberland Plate. A 0 to 70 handicap from one is Gambit, Martin Eden, two Avalanche Obi Wan, three Cathedral Kensington, Darren French, four is Ruby Swirl, Alex Cherry, and five is Whitechapel Town for Martin Eden, who's double handed in this five horse event. It's the Cumberland Plate from Carlisle, Stephanicia. We suit some hold up horses. And away they go. Slowly away was uh, Gambit. Uh, quickly away, Cathedral Kensington. Uh, no one wants to lead here. They're all pulling for their head. A reluctant leader is Avalanche. Uh, on the inside is Gambit. In between horses is Alex Cherry's Ruby Swirl. And out wide, Whitechapel Town uh, decide that there's uh, not much pace on the Whitechapel Town has decided to go up and lead. So Whitechapel Town leads from Sable Companion Gambit in second. On the outside of that is Ruby Swirl. Then comes Obi Wan's Avalanche in the back of the field, Cathedral Kensington in Darren French's second strip, uh, the Grey Horse at the back of the field. So Whitechapel Town from Martin Leadham in the red colours and yellow cap from the second horse Gambit in his lilac and white strip and then comes Ruby Swirl for Alex Cherry in his orange colours orange sleeves, orange cap colours they're followed by Avalanche for Obi-Wan in his yellow colours with the orange epaulets on the sleeve and at the back of the field we have Cathedral Kensington for Darren French about six lengths off this leader so the Cumberland Plate leader is Whitechapel Town for Martin Leadham who is also got the horse in second Gambit uh, on the outside of Ruby Swirl is Avalanche and at the back of the field Cathedral Kensington the grey horse only about six lengths off this leader as they've got six lengths, first six furlongs left to travel then Whitechapel Town tries to extend from the front uh, Avalanche moving past Gambit in second, then comes uh, Cathedral Kensington. Ruby Swirl trapped for some room for a stride or two, has moved on to the outside of Gambit now, but Whitechapel Town still the leader from a pushed along Avalanche in second, then Gambit on that one's inside. The second grey is Cathedral Kensington for Darren French, and in between horses Ruby Swirl for Alex Cherry, who's got nowhere to go and is uh, trapped for room again, uh, where the uh, horse is trapped for galloping room in a five horse race. It's Whitechapel Town leads from Avalanche in second. In third is Gambit, then comes Cathedral Kensington, still nowhere to go, Ruby Swirl is switched to to the outside for a clear run. It's Whitechapel Town with two fellows left to travel, travelling strongly in front, but here comes Cathedral Kensington trying to wear this one down for Darren French. It's Whitechapel Town from Cathedral Kensington, then comes Avalanche, Ruby Swirl and Gambit. It's Whitechapel Town still in front for the fellow to go, Cathedral Kensington is finishing strongly up the centre of the track. Whitechapel Town still in front, here comes Cathedral Kensington, Whitechapel Town needs the line, Cathedral Kensington out wide for Darren French and Cathedral Kensington is going to bow and by. Cathedral Kensington draws and by and go in a way for Darren French from Whitechapel Town, the long time leader in second. So from last to first for Cathedral Kensington. And the Grey Horse wins for Darren French from Whitechapel Town in second. Close for third but I think Obi-Wan's horse got that. No doubt about the winner though. Cathedral Kensington, Darren French, Whitechapel Town second for Martin Leadham, Avalanche third for Obi-Wan, Ruby Swirl for Alex Shows back in fourth and Gambit finished last for Martin Leadham. So Darren French wins the Cumberland Plate for at Carlisle.